Welcome back to Inside Southeastern Baseball with head coach J.R.T. presented by your local Southern Quality Four Dealers and also Champagne Beverage. The Lions were on the road to San Antonio, Texas for a three-game conference set. Let's check out their Friday night highlights against UTSA. Friday night in San Antonio, you can see that wind howling out there. I tell you, the wind was really blowing, but unusual. wind was blowing in on this night. They had their, their ace on the mound. He did a good job early on. A lot of life on all his pitches. Michael Rutman gets out front there. Brock Aber hits that ball hard up the middle. Good job of Brock. We love seeing him get on the bases with his speed. Second in the nation in stolen bases. He's one away from the school record here at Southeastern. Jonathan Pace gets a little bit out front. Ball makes a tricky hop. The shortstop makes a very nice play on that ball. Very nice play to get out of. Andro Chutora, a true freshman. He has been outstanding for us. Andro's 5-1 and one now. Feels position very well, which is... You know, one of the things that people don't recognize how important that is, but such a good athlete when that man bounces off, makes that play. This was my fault. He had called the wrong pitch. Hitter did a good job taking advantage of it. Andre threw it where I called it. It just, that was a bad job on my part. But Andre did a great job staying in command. Hey, Rhodes. Hits that ball hard at the middle for a single. Good job hitting that ball hard on the ground. That infield was very, very fast. I tell you, ground balls were getting through very easy because it was so fast. We'll strike him out, throw him out. Ball in the dirt, and Hoff chases it. Got to let the ball get a little bit deeper. But Pony Boy, Andre Chutor, was in command. Did a great job against a good hit in San, a San Antonio team. That was a nice shot right there by Harry Slade. Line drive right back through the middle. Almost took his cap off a of pitcher. Good job by Harry getting lines going. See Coach Max with his hard hat. Ball out front. Gets Michael Rutt in the chase once again. Strike three. Pony Boy stayed in command. Andre Chutor really did a great job just dominating a good hitting team. Oh, Harry Slade on the run looked like Tim Tebow on that one. Cody Gog hits a big hopper. Shortstop comes in, makes a nice play. I tell you, that infield played really, really well tonight. So did our little freshman Pony Boy. Andre Chutor did a great job dominating. I tell you, this kid is special. You see a lot of great things from him. You can see uh, Hoffman pull off of that ball right there instead of trying to go the other way. Left on left, he really didn't try to go the other way, and he was trying to pull off on that, and it's going to be struggling to hit that pitch. They had a little hit and run action going here. First pitch, hit and run. They started to get aggressive because Pony Boy was doing a great job. Huge part of the ball game. Up one nothing. First and third, no outs. They safety squeeze, but Andre feels the position so well, gets off the mound, throws the guy to third base. That's a tremendous play by any pitcher, much less a freshman. Bounce off the mound, makes the play. They try to straight steal. Fish throws him out for the second out. They go from first and third, no outs, to run at second and two outs. Tell a little missed sign by the hitter. And then Pony Boy gets that fly ball. Cody Gogg camps under it. Huge part of the ball game right there. They had a chance to extend their lead, and we didn't allow them to. And here come the Lions. Ben Hernandez had a super, super weekend. Hits that ball hard at the middle. Can't quite make the play because of Ben's speed. Great job by Ben. Michael Rutland. It's a big hopper. Second baseman made a nice play coming over there, but Rutland speed, he beats it out. Good job by Michael. Put runners at the corners first and third. And Brock Abrea laces a single up the middle. Brings in Ben, tying the ball game. Good job by Brock. Swinging the bat very well, hitting over 400 for us. Jonathan Pace, big part of the ball game. Two hoppers short. He tries to rush the throw because Abrea got there so quick. Throws it away. That was a big, big play for us. And I'll tell you, that play was set up because of Brock Speed busting his tail to second base, put some pressure on it. would have been a bang, bang play on that routine ball. Great job of Ladd letting that ball get deep in the zone, laying off of it. Saw the spin on it because it was so late in the zone. Good job of Ladd of hitting, laying off a tough pitch. You see as Todd Dunnington spans the field, bases loaded. Wild pitch, here comes Bear. Great job, good job base on hunting that ball down with two outs. They get Jacob Fisher swing out front. The pitcher settled in and made a nice pitch on it. Give him some chase. Andre was staying in command. There you see, gets a fly ball left field. Lad Rose gets under it. That ball was way up there. Lad makes the play. This is a big at bat, great at bat. Two outs, ball up the middle. Great base running by Ben Hernandez. Good third base coaching by Coach Roger. Sending him there, very good job, and that's a good job by Michael getting a second base. 
You don't have to be the fastest guy to be a great base runner. You just got to think with your head up and play aggressively, and he does that right there. Good job of Michael. As you can see, Poo Poo make a great turn around third base. Michael Poo Poo Rutland coming in to score. Big inning for the Lions, even though he left Mamu hanging right there. The ground ball second base. We get out of another jam. Great job of pitching, I'll tell you what. Turn it over to Dylan Hills. Andre was very good. Seven strong innings. Dylan Hill comes in for the eighth and blows it right by that hitter. The strike three. Dylan was really good all weekend for us. Turn it over to Lopez at the lead in the ninth. And like my favorite Catalano says, game over. He just absolutely blows it by the guys. Exploding fastball. One out, two outs, three outs. Lions win. Take the Friday night game at San Antonio. That save, Lopez, 13th save of the season. Uh, he's an all-time saves leader at Southeastern. Single season and career. Great job by Lopez. Andre Tutor, 5-1. and one. They bear three hits on the night. Coach, big victory on Friday night. Andre Tutor, outstanding once again. And Stefan Lopez becomes the Southeastern single season saves leader. Yeah, Andre did exactly what you want on a Friday night guy. Pitched really deep into the ball game. Dominated a good, good hit in San Antonio team. Went seven strong. Dylan Hills pitched a strong eighth. And Stefan Lopez, what do you say about the kid? I mean, he's phenomenal. Gets a close, comes in and gets a save, and you know, sets an all-time record for single season here at Southeastern. All right, let's go back out to UTSA and check out the Saturday highlights. Here we go, another beautiful day in San Antonio. As you can see, what in the cloud in the sky. Good job by Harry Slade. Harry swung the bat very well. He's been swinging the bat well for us. Good job leading things off for us. Single. Brock Hebert hits his ball, crushes it deep left field. Wind was really blowing in. I tell you, he got a hold of that pitch. Scores Harry Slade. Brock gets all the way to second base for a double. Cody Geiger, great job. A two strike hit, hit that ball down that line. Great job. A two strike, two out hit by Cody Geiger, and he gets to second base with his speed. Scoring Hebert. Good job by Cody. Jordan Hemel is on the mound. Hits a hard comeback or back to the mound. Just don't turn. I tell you, that was a big play. You didn't realize that, but it ended up being a huge play. High pop up. Ben Hernandez gets under, makes a nice play. That was a huge. I tell you, a double play ball, line drive right at Brock. Just took his eye for a second, and that led to three runs at the end. And that would have got us out the end with no runs. They get the blue pier, and this ended up running, leading to three runs. That was a big part of the ball game. San Antonio goes on and wins 9-3. Coach, tough loss on Saturday. Just a couple balls, you know, here or there. You think back to the double play ball that Brock Aber had a chance at, but, hey, it just wasn't your day on Saturday. Yeah, it didn't play very well. We didn't field our position on the mound. Didn't come out of the bullpen ready to pitch. You know, we dropped that double play ball. And, you know, but luckily winning on Friday night gives us a chance to win that series on Sunday. So the Lions will be going for the series on Sunday. Let's take a look at that when we come back right here on Inside Southeastern Baseball with Head Coach J.R.T. presented by your local Southern Quality Four Dealers and also Champagne Beverage.